Let's talk about variables and how to use them in a program. It's rarely that you're going to write a program which doesn't make use of variables. So this is an extremely important concept when it comes to programming. Before I begin, let's just say a little bit about what a variable is. A variable is a named piece of memory which your program can put data into or take data out of. It's called a variable because its contents can change as the program runs. As you can see here, I've already inserted a module and I've already got a procedure stub which I can start writing code into and you'll notice here as well I have the words option explicit at the top of the module. I'll explain what that means a little bit later but suffice to say this is actually an important thing to put at the top of every module that you create from now on. Okay, let's begin by creating a variable. I'm going to use a dim statement. I'm going to create a variable called, I'll just call it x for now. So my variable has a name and I'm now going to specify its data type and I do that using the as clause. This particular variable will hold a whole number, otherwise known as an integer. When this program runs and this line of code executes, the operating system will set aside a piece of the computer's memory and it will give it the name X. We don't actually care where it is in the memory, that doesn't matter, but there is a piece of memory called X that we can get access to now. We use the dim statement which is short for dimension because what we're actually doing is setting aside a specific amount of memory, enough memory to hold an integer value. Okay, now let's put something into that piece of memory. x equals 10. When this line of code executes, it will assign the value 10 to the variable. In other words, it will put the number 10 into that piece of memory. This is known as assignment. And next I'm going to output the contents of that variable. And I can do that using a message box statement. That will display it on the screen. Notice I haven't put double quotes around x because I want the contents of the variable to be displayed in the message box, not literally the letter X. So let's give that a go. F5 to run the program, and it's displaying the value 10. Just to recap, I've declared the existence of the variable using a dim statement. I gave the variable a name, and I specified its data type. In this line of code, I've assigned a value to the variable, in this case the number 10, and in this line of code I'm outputting the contents of that variable.